Hello, everybody. You get a shiny faced shish today. Uh, I got a facial, so I did some skincare today. So I'm like extra moisturized and I don't want to put makeup over top of it. So you get an extra no makeup yet shiny face shish today. Hi, everyone. I don't have that long to stream today because tonight is Logan's back to school night and I get to meet his teacher and all that kind of stuff because his first day of first grade is tomorrow. It's wild. It is absolutely wild. I can't believe the school year is starting back so soon. STS says shiny faced AI replicant. No, no AI replicant. Just me. Just me. How's your day going? Happy Wednesday, everybody. We're halfway through the work week. This is good. Um, I'm going to put a poll up real quick for those of you who are the early birds here in chat. Dinobot, Dinobot actually let people know we were going live today. Uh, but I'm going to do a new poll for today's game since we don't have a lot of time. Uh, should we play more Baldur's Gate 3, which I've been thinking about nonstop and can't wait to play more of, or Palea, which is still in its closed beta and is so super cute. I'm okay with either. I would like to play either of those things. So the poll is at the top of chat. Give a little refresh. STS says, remember to bribe the teacher with treats or threaten with violence. Oh, no. Uh, no, no violence. Teachers have it hard enough as is. They have it hard enough as is. Uh, hi, Tang Shade X. Dante, U.S. school never used to start this early. I remember starting in September when I was a kid. Um, and some schools here don't start till September. I just happen to be in a school district that starts early somehow. It's still summer and the heat is scorching indeed. Although, to be fair, I live in the desert, so that's how it is weather-wise most of the year. Um, Faye Photo says a poll. You're not going to play Baldur's Gate 3? What's up? Yeah, August school does feel wrong. Like, September is the traditional back-to-school month, right? Um, it depends on whether you live in the north or the south. Okay. And Cleric says, yep, in my part of Texas, we start on Monday. There it is. Yeah, Logan starts tomorrow, and he has a half day tomorrow and a half day on Friday, and then he starts full day on Monday. Just wild. Curazar says Southern schools start earlier because it's hotter. Okay. Which I feel like we were just saying maybe you would start later because it's still too hot right now. I don't know. I don't know how it works. I don't make these decisions. They're above my pay grade. Flying Cosmo, your starts Monday too. Um, and Compsai Dude says, yeah, usually the Catholic and private schools start the day after Labor Day. Yeah. Uh, they have invented a new form of math. There's actually a parent math handbook that I could look at to learn how to math all over again in a new way. And I'm like, you know what? I was great at math the way it was before. I was a mathlete, okay? I don't know that I want to learn how to new math. <laughs> I liked math how it was. All right, fifth in a very close vote. 56% of you voted for Baldur's Gate 3, while 44% of you voted for Palea. Very close. So at least I feel good about my feelings of like, hmm, the two games I really want to play today are BG3 and Palea. Um, so thank you, everybody, for weighing in on, uh, on that because I was being indecisive. But like I said, I want to play both, so I am happy with either. All right. So let me put us on Baldur's Gate. I feel like this always happens with new games that come out, but streamers that stream like 12 hours a day every single day are so much farther into the game than I am. All right, let's see. It's telling me it wants a new NVIDIA driver. Um, did that just get released? Because I just upgraded my NVIDIA driver on this PC like a couple days ago, I feel like. Drivers. Just released yesterday. Yep, it released yesterday. All right, well, I'm going to install a driver real quick while we're hanging out. <laughs> uh, you didn't spend 15 years learning math just to relearn it for some reason? Dude, I get you. I get you. Did I find all the companions yet? No, I definitely, definitely did not. Sometimes a driver update once rebooting, but even if it does, it's on my gaming PC, not my streaming PC, so I won't have to turn off the... Uh, the stream if that happens and it gives me time to get everything ready 
for the stream today. Although I hope it happens fairly quickly because, like I said, I don't have a lot of time to stream today. Yeah, the companions I haven't gotten yet. There's quite a few I haven't gotten yet as far as I know. Um, I know Maud always talks about how much she hates Gale, and I vaguely remember Gale from the early access, but we don't have that person. Um, and I think there's other people we don't have too. I have three NPCs in my party right now, um, in addition to myself. So I have a full for four person party, but it's like the first three you meet, I guess, unless I missed somebody, which maybe I did. I don't know. Sweet Bri, that's so nice of you. You said anytime we get with you, streaming is fine by me. I'm glad you can stream when you can. Thank you. Um, yeah, I had like meetings and stuff like that all morning and then I went for my skincare appointment, which was supposed to happen the week I was in Korea, but I pushed. And, uh, I know I laugh about this all the time, but the, the great Adam Sessler told me the best thing you can do for yourself is on camera talent is get monthly facials, like to take care of your skin. Um, and so I've taken that to heart since then and I try to make sure that I go and once a month get a little... Got a little extra moisture on there um, so that, I don't know, I, I look old and wrinkly a little less as I get older. I don't know. Um, am I doing a separate multiplayer run? Not right now. Uh, Irdle says, is your whole party worm ridden? I think so, yes. Well, yeah, actually, yes. Yes, I think so at this point. Thorid says you couldn't do skincare in Korea. I could. They actually have some of the best skincare in the world in Korea, but I wouldn't have known where to go for that, and I wasn't about to go someplace random. Like, I trust I trust the lady I go to here. She's wonderful. Um, and that's something that you want to, like, heavily research first before someone, like, messes with your face. <laughs> Dante. I mean, he's not wrong. Yeah, he, Adam Sessler was right. When you work on camera for a living, take care of that face skin if you can. Dude, the shampoo and conditioner in Korea was awesome. Not gonna lie, it was pretty cool. But there's still all the airline rules. You can't, like, smuggle. I guess I could have in my checked bag, but I like to fly without checking a bag. I don't play that game with my luggage. I'm carry-on only kind of gal. Um, watch you go in for a skincare and get a chemical peel and steel wool rub down. No, 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 I did not do that. No, 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 no. No, 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 I've got, like, some moisture up in there. Oh, yeah, just just the good stuff for me today. Just the good stuff. Okay, graphics driver installed. Fine, fine. Good. It doesn't stay a restart is required, so hopefully we should be good. Okay, in that case, BG3, indeed. Uh, let's see. I thought that the better quality games would lift all tides and promote other dev companies to put out better quality gaming. I mean, Larian Studios is an exception, CompSci, dude. Larian Studios does amazing things with their games and always have. And it's always, like, quite the undertaking when they do. I'm a huge Larian Games fan. Uh, I, I am very much so enjoying Baldur's Gate as well as uh, the Divinity Games. So I'm excited about it. Now let's see. Here we go. I think the game is loading up for me now. I'll change everything over when we get there. Okay. Oh, but it's defaulting to full screen, so I might have to readjust my graphics settings. Have I installed the hotfix too? Whatever the latest patch is, I'm updated. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so let me change my graphic settings before we switch things over because it's all sorts of messed up right now and I don't want that no thank you borderless window is where it's at for me please I did read an article saying for Baldur's Gate 3 that you get better frame rates if uh if you have it on full screen and not borderless window but I'm not about to make you guys watch it with bars on the top and bottom because I play it on an ultra wide monitor I'm not about that life, so we're going to keep it borderless window. Although it's been running pretty fine for me thus far. Difficulty balanced. We're currently in the Emerald Grove, and my character's name is Belladonna. The music's a bit loud. Okay, thank you for letting me know. Uh, let me just make sure that my microphone has not adjusted its level since this morning. I was recording this morning, and it was at proper level this morning. 
it, sh it should be closer to there. It did adjust its own level, but not to the degree that I should be super worried about. Thank you, Al, by the way. I appreciate that. Um, doo -doo -doo. Hi, Gilman Griff. I hear the, like, faint bird chirping as we're loading in. Okay. I still have yet to, like, camp for the night once, and I feel like maybe that's what my party should do next. But, yeah, here's my party. That's Belladonna, my halfling fighter. I've got Shadowheart, Astarian, and Lazelle. That's, that's my party as of right now. We just made a beautiful little tune Another with someone back sound. there, and now I'm just exploring new parts of the map. So... <laughs> Singing, it's beautiful. Uh, what's over here? Is, is someone singing? It's beautiful. Secluded Cove. I do hear the singing. But also, spoilers, I played this part in early access, so I know. <laughs> I know what's about to go down if I investigate the singing, so maybe I don't want to do that. I'm just a little bean. I'm going to give a little save. Because I think in early access, when I investigated the singing, it resulted in a total party kill. <laughs> but let's see. Let's see if it happens again in the same way. It is a side mission to investigate the singing. Look, there's someone up here. Such a pretty song. Can I go talk to this dude? Shh. Listen. Listen quietly. You shouldn't be standing out in the water. It's dangerous. Uh, let's say you shouldn't be standing out in the water. It's dangerous. Don't you hear it? It's so peaceful. I don't hear anything. Come back to the shore. No, no. It's just a bit of water. I only want to listen. Just a little closer. Baby, no. Yeah, baby, no. Yes, everything's gonna be fine once I get there. No, no, no. Yeah, initiative. Commence battle. Exactly. <laughs> No, thank you. No, no. No, no, no. Um, okay, let's see. Astarian gets to go first before Harpy 1. So we got three Harpies, then Shadowheart, then the little boy, then the fourth Harpy before the rest of my party. So Astarian gets the main move. And I'm wondering if he can, like, he could shove, but I don't know that that's going to help the kid. Fallen 1, thank you for the resub. And also, by the way, when I started the stream today... Uh, I believe we had Eardle the Albonian resub as well. So thank you so much for the resubs, friends. Knock the child unconscious? Uh, or need that silence spell? Do we have... I think actually Shadowheart might have the silence spell. Minor illusion, color spray, chromatic orb, hide. Uh, let me just see if she does have it. Charm person, disguise self, turn undead, or cure wounds. No. Stinker. She doesn't have it. Um, alright. Well, let's go back to Asterion. I could try to knock the kid unconscious. Although that seems not great. Hide, dip, throw, help. Help downed characters. Uh, remove burning, ensnared, entangled, and webbed, prone, and sleeping. It's Lord is what he is, which Lord is not listed on there, so that won't work. I could dash to him and or jump to him and try to, like, grab. I don't, there's no, like, grab. I'm trying to figure out. Maybe charm? He can't do charm. I could do try to blind them. 
Yeah, silence would be so good right now. I could try. Can I have them sleep, maybe? I don't know if I can. Target is too far. Uh, so I'm, okay, I'm gonna have... Jump is a bonus action, and I can get him not enough movement. I could get him here, no? Yes, I could get him here. And then I can use my movement to come up here, because there is a harpy there. Uh, blind creatures up to a combined 33 hit points. That could, How many hit points do they each have? 24. Um, Mage Hand can't grab the kid, can it? I could go for sleep, but it's only going to hit that one. I won't be able to hit the other, I mean, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go for that one. Okay, one of them's asleep. Great. Uh, awesome. End of Starian's turn. No! Leave that baby! How dare you. How dare you hit Belladonna. That one's singing, so that's who we need to hit. Resisted the song. Okay, good job, Shadowheart. Good job. Sleep the boy? Oh, we could sleep the boy, and then he couldn't hear it. Good call. That would have been so smart. Uh, alright, let's see. Do I not have a level one sp spell slot right now? Am I out of that for the day? Oh, no! I don't have any spell slots left? Oh, no! I've got cantrips, and that's it. Flame... Guidance, Firebolt, or make a target more resistant to spell effects and conditions. It receives a 1d4 bonus to saving throws. Does that work now that the kid's already lured? Um. Yeah, what if... I gotta, I gotta hit that, uh... Heart stopper. I gotta hit this one who's singing, but I'm not close enough. Heading there. Can't get there. What do you mean can't get there? Just get there. Is it because Belladonna's in the way? It might be because Belladonna's in the way. Um, can I hit the singer from here? No. Stinker. Uh, can I? What has 18 meters? That's what the range is on this, too. The radiant damage. Turn undead is not gonna help us. I did not long rest. It was stupid of me. It was stupid of me. Um, well, you know what? I could try doing resistance on the boy. Oh, target must be an ally. Gosh darn it in a bag of chips. Well, at least I can give Belladonna that. So hopefully they'll resist. Okay. All right. I guess it's the end of her turn. No! Uh-uh, we gotta save this boy. Oh, going for Shadowheart. Rough! Shadowheart just... Oh, that was bad. Alright, Lizel might have to just take this thing for a spin, you know? Let's see what else we got. Second wind, shove. Uh, Goading attack. Goads an enemy into t attacking you. That could be good. Disarming attack. Let's look at our new ones. Distracting strike. Distracting strike could be good. Distracting strike ranged could be really good. Um, because that'll break its concentration. Goading attack. 
Let's try distracting strike ranged on this buddy right here. It does say it's outside our normal range, but I could have her move first. My path be true. And now try distracting strike ranged. 45%. Let's try it. Yes! Yes! Concentration broken? Yeah, no... There should be no more singing. Why is there still singing? <laughs> Why is there still singing? Uh, action surge. I still wish there was a way I could, like, go grab the boy. But there's not really. Like, Mage Hand can't really do that, I don't think. Oh, they are not just trying to have choir practice. They're trying to eat a baby. Uh-uh. We don't, we don't abide by child murder here. Okay, Belladonna. I mean, if we take out this one, hopefully, distracted, which means I'd get, I guess the advantage and disadvantage would cancel each other out there. Um, now, I also have these fancy attacks I could do. Frightens your target, would be easier to hit and can't move. Sweeping attack, menacing attack, frightens your target, yeah. Um, okay. Uh, scroll of revivify, maybe, if we need to. What else do I have? A spiked bulb I could throw? Alchemist fire? I could maybe catch it on fire? Uh, let's see what else I have. Scroll of ray of enfeeblement. Scroll of protection from good and evil. I guess I could use the void bulb to knock the kid back. Or to knock this thing off of there so it's a little easier to hit. I'm trying to be a friend to all, you know? Let's do... I, I think I just gotta take out this harpy if I can. So, I'm gonna say... Disarming attack? I don't know if it has any weapons on it, though. Let's just go for regular ranged attack. You can take me in. Okay, I hit it again. It's distracted. I might take an extra action point. Well, I can, actually. Oh, pummel strike, I can't. Because I've already used it this short rest. Um, but I could do a potion of speed. Basic poison. Wyvern toxin. Uh, or healing. I should probably heal Shadowheart. Did I heal my... Uh, that didn't heal Shadowheart. That healed me. No. Uh, I could go up here by the kid at least. That is not what I wanted to do. Okay. Resisted the song again. I mean, he could really take aim there or... He's at disadvantage if he shoots there, but that would take out the one that's singing. I'm sure another one would just start singing after that. Let's see. 65%. I'd get a plus on high ground. Um, I have to take a short rest before I can do that again. Poison spray. What has a greater... Uh, chromatic orb. I don't have any more level 1 spell slots. Minor illusion. Could be okay. I know, I should have read that ability description. That's on me, Raisin Ox. You're right. You're right. Um, alright. I think we're gonna go with this. To the Concentration <laughs> broken for Luring Song. Okay, well, it's got three hit points left. But at least it's not singing anymore. So hopefully the little boy's okay. Uh, I could now do a flourish, but there's no one near me. What can I do bonus action-wise? I could jump. Potion of Glorious Vaulting. Drink this to triple your jump distance. That's pretty funny. Um, cunning action hide, I guess. I could go hide. There. I don't know if I'm actually hidden. It doesn't look very hidden to me. Um, but, 
All right, that's going to be the end of his turn, unless I want to move down more, but I can't really. Okay. Okay, now that one's singing. Did it get all of us? This is how I end up with a TPK. This is bad. Okay, Shadowheart resisted the song, which Shadowheart desperately needs to heal. Cure wounds, healing word. Uh, inflict wounds is necrotic damage. 55, 55. Belladonna's lord. Who's lord? I thought. Mm. Detect thoughts, resistance, difficult terrain, inspect, and luring song. Ugh. Uh, what can we do? I guess I could take out this one because it only has three left. Fire. Do I have anything that's area of effect damage on Shadowheart? I, d I don't think I do on Shadowheart. Mm. Blessing of the Trickster. Sacred Flame. I could try Sacred Flame over here. Uh, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. I think I'm just gonna firebolt this buddy. And I missed? I'm right there! Are you flipping kidding me? And that only healed four. Oh, Shadowheart is so done. Unless, let me move Shadowheart all the way over here by a friendo. Oh, opportunity attack! I'm so stupid! I'm so stupid! <laughs> this is gonna be a TPK for sure. Oh my gosh. Well, there goes Shadowheart, but the kid resisted the song. Nope, didn't resist this. Why are you going to that harpy? Are you going home? Go home, child. Go home, child. All right, I'm going to have to. I do have a scroll of Revivify. Okay, if a member of your party reaches zero, they're downed. This is a state between life and death. On three successful rolls, they became stable. On three failures, they die. So I basically have three turns to figure this out. Um... All right. Ugh! Helping downed characters. Uh, I can use that to help the character or that. Now, at this point, I want... Poison spray. What can we do? Minor illusion might be really nice here. Or sneak attack. Must have advantage. Must have advantage. I have no advantage on any of these, so it's not going to be a sneak attack move. I could do poison spray at this bad boy. Or that one. Um, not enough space. Where can I put the illusion? Over here, maybe? Right here? <laughs> I, need to, I need to make an illusion so that they... Yeah, every, investigation successful. So this one didn't fall for it. Uh... <laughs> Flourish, I can do as a bonus action. I could also heal myself, which I think needs to happen. Okay, if I don't want to die. Uh, now, if I do run away, I will deal with an opportunity attack, and I don't want to deal with that. So that one's what? singing. What is happening? I will have your head. Wait, what? No! Oh, the, oh no, the sleeping one woke up! Oh no! Where's it going? Oh, it's going to attack the illusion. Yes, please go attack the illusion. The little boy resisted the song. Little boy, where are you going? Oh, this is so bad! This is so bad! You're saying run away? I just wanted to save this kid. That's all. Now where is Lizelle? She's... Belladonna's Lord. This one still has full health. Astral Knowledge. Goading attack is not good right now. I do have... What is this? Second wind is healing. Drawing my stamina to heal myself. Um, 
Goading attack, disarming attack. Distracting attack. I'm gonna do distracting attack melee. Let's try it. And I totally missed! This is the worst. Although I, did I heal, healing on me? Okay. And I'm gonna have to do, I'm doing my action surge. And I'm gonna try again. Yeah, action surge. Distracting attack, melee again, I'm gonna try it. Okay, distracted and concentration saving throw was successful, so it's still singing. Um, all right. And Lysel's turn. Belladonna's lured, so there's nothing I can do. Can't control. Oh, Astarion's so dead here. It's not- uh, Oh, no, it's Astarion's turn! Ah, uh, Piercing strike. Again, do we have any area of effect things? Will poison spray... No, it will not hit them both. I could try Minor Illusion again. But it didn't work great last time. Protection from good and evil. Do I have any other... No, I don't... I could scroll of Revivify, but that's not gonna help me. Oh, this is so bad. This is so bad. <laughs> um... 24. Okay, I'm trying to take out this one that only has three left. But I probably shouldn't use. Uh, let's see if I can get. Flourish might work. As a bonus action. No target, I guess. That's my target. Uh, okay, before we flourish, I'm gonna try Piercing Strike. Of course I missed. Flourish. Okay, whew, one down. Uh, but now I didn't use my bonus action to heal myself at all. Whoops, he's dead. He's dead. All I wanted to do was save a kid. Oh, missed. Thank goodness. Ah, oh, Lizelle, I wish you could have made that hit. Rejected the song. Kid, go home. Yeah, run home, baby boy. What are you doing? Just go home. Asterian's dead? No, Asterian is barely, a barely. One left. One hit point left. Uh, okay, I can't do second wind. Wait, was that Lizel? Oh, I thought it was Hysterian. Um, that's alright. Lizel's doing okay right now. I'll take that for her. Let's also do goading attack melee, goading attack range. Disarming attack melee. Disarming attack melee. Oh, target must have a weapon to do that. Just kidding. Um... So we can't do goading, disarming. I guess we could try distracting again. Alright. This isn't right. No, this isn't right. <laughs> you just you're just getting that now? Uh and I can't help her up yet. But I do have the movement to at least get there as Lizelle. So I'm gonna go there to try to help up if I can. Uh, and now Belladonna finally gets to go. Let's turn this around. We've got this harpy over here and the harpy up here that's about to kill Astarian. I don't know if there's any way I can reach this harpy. Like, even if I wanted to. Yeah, there's, there's no way I can make that happen. Um, but I could 
Menacing attack range frightens your target. They'll be easier to hit and cannot move. Let's try that. Nice! Oh, that was so clutch. Uh, I don't think I can do anything to heal a friendo. Like, I can't... I can't throw this to somebody else. Um... Wyvern Toxin. My bonus actions right now are basically nothing I could do. I guess I could jump. I could jump over here, or I could jump up here. Oh, that's what I should have done. I should have jumped. No, it says not enough movement. I can't make that leap. That's fine. I'm going to jump to right here. Um, and I don't have this anymore. I must take a short rest before I can use it again. So I'm going to end Belladonna's turn there. It is Asterion's turn, and boy, oh boy, does he need to heal. Potion of Glorious... I guess I could have him vault. Glorious vaulting. And get away. You can throw potions and also move them in between inventories, even in battle. Ah, okay, thank you. I did look at chat, but he has a potion. I'm not saying he didn't have a potion. I just didn't know if you could, like, on Belladonna's turn, have Asterion take a potion. Alright, so he's healing up a little bit, but I still don't know how much it's going to help him. We still have 24 here. Uh, weakening Strike, non-lethal, possibly inflicts weak, weak grip. Um, disengage and run. Throw. Oh, you can throw a potion at Shadowheart and it will heal her. Oh, I see. Now, I don't have advantage on this guy, so I can't do any sneak attacks. I can do 1 to 12 there, or 1 to 10 here, or 4 to 11 here. Um, I mean, let's go with our poison spray and hope he gets poisoned. He got hit for 5, but it doesn't seem like he's poisoned. Returned. He might still get taken out next turn. Up, oh, and there goes that stupid song again. No! And the boy's lord again? No! Lizel is. How come I keep getting lured by the song even though Shadowheart tried to help me? Uh, this one only has seven left, so I could take it out. How is poor Shadowheart doing? Downs, resisted the song, tenacity. How are we doing on our saves, though? What's that up and down mean right there? How many, like, what is that? Is she almost dead? She's stable. Okay, she's stable. All right, so you're saying that Lizel should help Shadowheart. Um, this is a full action, though. She doesn't get an attack if I do that. But, you're saying bonus action, I could throw this? No, throw's an action, too. Uh, uh. STS, you're saying to help her, so I guess I'm gonna help her. But I don't know that that was the play, because now we just wasted Lizelle's whole turn. That feels like that was not the play. <laughs> Because Lizelle's, like, the only one that is resisting the stong and, like, stands a chance here. Oh, so bad. Resisted the song, thank god. Uh, this did not get po I could try this, you know, scroll of protection from good and evil. I keep thinking it's burning hands, but it's not. Um, if I did the Potion of Glorious Vaulting, could I vault all the way over here and take this guy out? Although, maybe the best move from here is a ranged attack, because I am I have higher ground. Of course that was a miss. Of course it was. I'm taking another potion. Potion. 
STS, your backseat gaming didn't help me, man! <laughs> Oh, guys, we have some folks in chat that are not welcome. Womp womp. And just created this account. Oh, when? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry that you exist only to bring sad misery into other people's lives. Bye. Bye, person that's not welcome. Bye bye <laughs> I love those people that like think they're legit gonna rain on someone's parade. Just, I don't know, does that make them happier or something? It's just kind of annoying. Um, let's see. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, there's not really anything a Starian can do right now, unfortunately. Catsup couldn't resist the song either. Yeah, don't let the, don't let the door hit your hiney on the way out. Indeed. What? Okay. What was that? Shadowheart can actually move now, uh, but doesn't have any spells left, as far as I can see. Can't take an action for some reason. The only thing Shadowheart can do is shove, jump, or dip. That's it. That's all we got. Now, maybe if I can give Shadowheart a healing spell, she could take that? Uh, do I have any more? I do. I don't. Drink Shadowheart. Yes. Oh, good. It only healed her four. The, like, absolute worst it could do. Um, so she can move, but that's it. This is the worst. You should have stayed down. I guess I'll put her back there. Little boy. Run away, little boy. Yeah, go home to your mommy and daddy. Oh, no. Of course. Oh, and now Lizelle's lord. Oh, this is so bad. Alright, Belladonna at least resisted the stupid song. Shove, jump, dip is actually a popular dance from the 40s. <laughs> oh, I guess if the boy does live, it's a successful total party kill. Yeah. <laughs> Um, menacing attack, melee, disarming attack, melee. I don't know if I can get within melee range, can I? No, it's not. I can't disarm anyway. Menacing attack, ranged, menacing attack, melee. But I don't want it. 5 to 21 or 3 to 17. Let's see if I can... Not enough movement. Unless maybe I jump first and then do it? Because a jump. Yes. And then we're going to do menacing attack melee. What? Eat it, you turd. I will have your head, <laughs> Absolutely eat it, you turd. Uh, okay, song is out. Jump on the harpy. <laughs> Uh, no, it's not GG yet. We still have one very fully alive, almost full health harpy at this point. Uh, okay, but... Uh, at this point... Yeah, I'm gonna stay where I am as Belladonna. Astarian, it is your turn, my dude. And you probably do have advantage now. Oh, I don't have advantage? I thought maybe I would because we have a friend nearby, but I guess I don't. Um, 65% if I do that, but that's only 1 to 10. Let's get a ranged attack in. 75% with a ranged attack. 
Good. Shadow Heart can do nothing. Um, bonus action. I could heal myself one more time. I could hide. I can jump down. Maybe I'll jump down. Nice. Oh, I did take two damage in the jumping, though. That's not ideal. Okay, he's going after a Starion. No! Singing! No! Oh, this is bad. Okay, I... Belladonna resist, resisted the song, at least. Uh, I could try menacing attack ranged. 55%. Let's go for it. Oh, thank goodness. I will have your head, Harpy. Oh my goodness. We did not TPK, but it was close. It was close, my friends. You had nothing on you? This Harpy had no loot, by the way. Anything of use? Anything of use. No loot on that Harpy. I guess let's go uh, help out our friend. Be right there. Shadowheart, you okay? Mm. Yeah, I do want to do more stray gods for sure. Oh, Shadowheart. Yeah, we definitely need our long rest first, but I want to loot. Okay, we got to talk to this kid though too. Okay, good. Oh, nice. Thank goodness I got a bone. You have returned. Shumbo Wamba, welcome. Thank you for the sub. They're gone. Are you all right? Go back to your parents. There's worse than in the wilds than Harvey Snop Snibbling. They're gone. Are you all right? No. Yes. I mean, I don't know. Take a deep breath, deep and slow. You're safe now. Let's say go back to your parents. There's worse in the wilds than Harpies. They're, they're gone. Now there's just more. She'll be so mad. I didn't get the gold from the nest. I got to go. Wait, someone told you Wait, to get the um, gold from the nest? You should meet Mole. She'll be grateful you helped me. Find a boy called Donny. Tell him you want to see the dragon's lair. Okay. Looting. That harpy also had nothing. Apparently there's gold up here, so let's go try to check that out, I guess. Oh, there's something over there, at least. There's a pile of bones. Again, we did all this for like, ugh, a bone and a dagger? Are you kidding me? This is awful loot. I'm gonna come down here. Something good here, I hope. All right, at least there's some gold in that chest, but lordy. I see nothing we can loot here. I'm going to do a rest menu. Long rest. Do you want to end the day? Yes. Lord. Save rest. We're resting. All right, at your camp, you can take a long rest and fully heal your party. You can also manage party members, advance relationships with your companions, store items, and eventually change your character and recruit more followers. Okay, everybody. Oh, everybody wants to chat. It's quite a sight. The stars, I mean. I could take or leave your chin. Hmm, rude. He doesn't like my butt chin? Rude. I like it. Am I disturbing you? No. 
Just thinking. Reflecting on what tomorrow might bring. When we find the druid. Will he know how to bring the worm under control? Will this little adventure of ours be over? It doesn't have to be. We can still trap together. Probably. Once the worm is gone, I'm going my own way. I mean, no, I'm going to say what? Will you miss me? <laughs> Why not? You've been to the hells and back. Survived the crash. Survived everything that's followed. I'm not normally impressed by people of your stature. Rude. But you're stronger than I gave you credit for. I'm a shorty, okay? Uh, oh, I see that game on request. We hardly know each other. I thought you didn't like me. True, I am pretty impressive. I'm just trying to survive. I have many talents. If you want to explore them. Brown chicken, brown cow. Um, I'm going to say true. I am pretty impressive. Aren't you just... Uh, are you feeling all right? You can stop staring or turn and walk away. Um, I feel like now we walk away. I feel like we were like, it's true, I am impressive. And then this is our moment to take our leave. I feel like that's a pretty good exit. Sleep tight. I'll see you later. <laughs> I'm sure. Uh-huh. You wish, sir. Lizelle? A fine evening, don't you think? The moonlight shines warmly on us. The breeze caresses our faces. Hideous. All of it. Would that I were doing battle up there, among the tears. Ah, uh, what do you mean by the tears? Farron isn't so bad. Give it a chance. You want a battle up where? Let's say, uh, Faerun isn't so bad. Give it a- No, what do you mean by the tears? Look above. Watch the moon cross the sky. The tears follow behind it. Rocky bodies tumbling through the sea of night. One of them is my crash. Clear. Uh, are all Githyanki from the tears? It must be quite a shock. Or you mean you come from up there in the sky? Let's say, are all Githyanki from the tears? Was she always, okay, was Lazel also wearing that, se always wearing that sexy bra thing? I feel like that's new just for like the nighttime look. Your curiosity is to be commended. Githyanki are hatched in creches all throughout realm space. Kaleer is one of many. It's there I first saw a Kithrak mount a red dragon where I slit my cousin's throats at the Vaj's command. But enough of this. You are wasting your resting time. Come dawn, we resume our search for a crash. Okay, ma'am. Oh, there's a fallen tree here, apparently. Well, I could just sit on it. Oh yeah, we got Will. I forgot we told him to go back to our camp. through your head and down to your feet. Ah, there it is. That shiver. Our little brain worms have made fast friends, it would seem. <laughs> How do you feel? Fine, in spite of it all. Nervous or confident? Uh, surprisingly fine, in spite of it all. <laughs> Surprising is just the word, isn't it? Before the Elithid's unscheduled surgery, I'd felled hundreds of beasts and a fair few fiends. The tadpoles weakened me. Suppressed greater talents, but beyond that, I've showed no signs of turning. No nausea, no pain, not even a hot flash. Something special about us, or at least about our tadpoles. It makes no sense, I know, why haven't we turned? Or we could probably dig up some poison mushrooms if you're that keen to be sick. No, it makes no sense, why haven't we turned? Perhaps the worm's vat was poisoned. Perhaps we're uncommonly fit. Or... Perhaps the tadpoles are merely on holiday. We could conjecture all night. I suppose the why doesn't matter so much as the what next. Mm -hmm. And that answer is plain as the horns on a war devil's head. We get these things out. Let's get some rest. Dawn comes sooner than we think. Indeed. Uh, where's Shadowheart with her, like, one hit point? <laughs> 
could go to bed. Go to bed, go to bed. Oh, Shadow Heart's over here. Ooh, a traveler's chest. Whoa! I'm sorry. When did we get all this? Wait, we got underpants? What? Wait, what? Chatterbox tabard? Periwinkle underpants? Oh, it's part of the deluxe version? Oh my heavens. Bewildering Adventures Pack. Um, what do I do with that? I guess open it. Whoa! I got some poutine and a stew and some coffee and paella. A potion of animal speaking. All oh my heavens take all. So I did open that. What do I do with it now? What is this? Cape of the Red Prince? A loot? Bicorn? Wow. Take it all. Mask of the Shapeshifter. Level 1 Illusion Spell. Hmm. All right. We could maybe give that to Astarian. I don't know. Maybe I should put on these fancy shoes. Little purple shoes seem cute. What if I put on these underpants? Oh, the I just wear them underneath. It's not like I'm only wearing underpants. I guess I could be only wearing underpants if I wanted to. Uh, oh, that's the underwear I had before. That underwear is gross. I don't want that underwear. Um, the cape. Can I see what my new cape looks like? It's not on me yet. But I'm excited to see. I don't know if I want to wear that, that outfit because... I need my armor, but oh boy. Potion of flying? All right. Let's talk to Shadowheart. The leader of the pack comes to chat. What's on your mind? You must be pleased to have a clear path forward. The sooner we find the druid house in, the better. I can't wait to get rid of this thing in my head. I agree. Um... What will come next for you once all this is over? How are you feeling? No, how are you feeling? The same. These parasites are proving suspiciously benign. But suppose I turn. What would you do? Maybe I could leave you tied up while I hunted for a cure? No hesitations. I'd just send your misery then and there. Let's not do this. I don't like hypothetical questions. Or if you turned into a monster, I'd run away. Uh, maybe I could leave you tied up. Really? I'd just kill you. Rude. Anyway, get some rest. Try not to dream about tying me up. I thought maybe you'd find it sexy, okay? I could sleep there if I don't want to, like, sleep with everybody else. I guess. Um... Oh. Hello, Withers! We meet again, as predicted. Hi, Withers. I shall be here in thy camp, for whenever thou hast need of my services. Not to be rude, but what are you? You were sorting something before. What kind of services can a skeleton offer? Can you explain why you're helping me, or I'd prefer if you leave? Uh, care to explain why you're helping me? Be assured. It is not by choice. Okay. Um, what kind of services can a skeleton offer? Mending of the threads between life and death. Should thou or any of thy compatriots perish, 
I will cleave soul to body once more. Oh, so I don't need the scroll of revivify. You can just bring people back? Uh, you mentioned a cost. A matter of coin. Wait, 200 coin to bring someone back from the dead? What? What if I don't have that kind of gold right now? Uh, can you help me change my class? No, that's all fine. Seems fair. So it's not a free revivify, it's a 200 gold revivify. Weird. What's in this wooden trunk? Nothing. What's in this wooden crate? Nothing. I'm just exploring this beach. I don't feel comfortable falling asleep until I know what's around me. There's like a rope up there, it looks like. bucket and this brings me back up to camp all right i guess let me go to sleep did i invasion plans for the sword coast here we go this map of the sword coast sprawls from the deep forest of tether to the frigid spine of the world its topography worn by the by ancient ink and the constant trade between mortal hands interesting Weird. Oh, I guess I didn't loot that storage box. It was by will. Ah, all right. A bottle rack and a table? Nothing. Not even some wine or bottles there. Nope. Whose house is back here? Where is this? Where are we sleeping? Let me, um... I do have my torch. How do I pull out the torch? I guess I just have to switch to my other melee weapon, but how? Toggle light source, there we go. Um, what? I guess I could just sleep in here if I wanted to away from everybody else. I did grab a bedroll. Where's my bedroll? Drop items, custom add to where, send to camp. That doesn't really help me. I guess I can't just use it here. All right, I'll go back to camp with everybody else. It's fine. Just trying to be a little loner. Go to bed. Long rest. Uh, using the required amount of camp supplies to fully rest, recovering all your hit points, spell slots, and short rest. Not using enough camp supplies to rest will only partially recover your resources. Um, I mean, whoa, supply blacks have 40. Uh, let's use some, I mean, let's get rid of some stuff, right? We got all those sausages, a chicken, carrots, and some fire swill, and a red pepper. 40. Full rest. <laughs> uh huh, this fool. Oh, 
Okay, everybody's healed. Great. Things are saved. Um, alright. I guess we could talk to everybody in the morning, or we could just, like, get back to business. Um... The Githyanki people have a word for men like the Blade of Frontiers. Shalak. Roughly translated, idealist do-gooder. Or better yet, benevolent burden. His confidence is an asset. His pursuit of valor, not so much. Are you sure Crush is our only path to a cure? You look so unusual. Uh, no. Do you know much about mind flares or wait for me in camp? I'm not sure. If we're going to change up the party, it makes sense to not bring Lazel because we don't necessarily need two fighters in the party. Uh, but I like having two fighters in the party. Not going to lie. Um, I kind of like the party makeup we have now. So I guess it would be changing out Lazel for Will, but I don't know how I feel about that. Let's ask her what she knows about mind flares. Yeah, Shadow Heart's my healer, really. I understand much beyond your comprehension. More to the point, I know the cure for our condition. It is imperative we locate a crash. You do well to observe more and question less. Don't be rude. <laughs> um. Are you sure a crash is our only path to a cure? Entirely. I was as devoted to my studies as I was to my training. Each crash contains a Sathisk purification device. So I learned from the writings in the Kaleer Library. The uh -huh. library was a gift from Vlakith herself, that we may gain total understanding. And yes, Astarian is my rogue, Coffee Kempo. That kind of wisdom is very valuable. Books are fallible. Total understanding? Absolute nonsense. Let's just say that kind of wisdom is very valuable. I don't want to insult her. Countless scholars roam the astral sea and beyond, observing the ways of our lessers, exploring planes so distant order turns to chaos and cold fires rage. Although the are ever quaking, Will may be more helpful in finding Halson. The Githyanki possess an eternity of knowledge. Yet we still collect more, infinities upon infinities. Hmm. So, okay, I'm going to listen to chat. Should we switch out Lazel for Will? So that would be gaining a druid and losing our second fighter. So it's either fighter, fighter, cleric, rogue, or fighter, druid, cleric, rogue. Rogue. You're saying take Will? Yeah, you guys are saying yes. Yes, Will. You thought he was a warlock? Oh, is he a warlock? I thought he was a druid. Is he a warlock? Will is a warlock, everyone's saying. So then it would be fighter, warlock, cleric, rogue. Rather than fighter, fighter. You think, okay, wait for me Shook. in camp. You believe you can survive without me? Yes, I'm not arguing. Remain here. As you say, do not keep me waiting. Okay. The Blade of Frontiers at your calling. He was a pretty good fighter when we saw him in action. So I'm like, okay, I think this could be helpful. How does the Blade of the Frontiers end up chasing a devil in the hells? Tell me, Will. How did you come to be the Blade of Frontiers? I've noticed your stone eye. Did you lose it in battle? That's rude. Uh, tell me, Will. How did you come to be the B Blade of Frontiers? My father once said, one does not pursue a champion's life. One merely answers its call. So it was for me. I was hunting near the cloakwood when I heard it. A child crying out from a lone farmstead. I found him in the fields flanked by goblins. His mother's corpse bled into the soil next to him. That's awful. I don't remember much of the battle. But I remember drying the boy's tears after. Hmm. What act could be finer than saving a life? You must have felt proud. Um, and he named you the Blade of Frontiers? Whatever became of the boy, I wonder. Or Goblin's Pitiful Vermin. Uh, let's say whatever became of the boy, I wonder. 
I left him with his uncles. Five years on, and he's flourishing. If only every child was so lucky. I mourn the ones I could never save, whose cries I never heard. In the boy's tears, I finally saw the suffering wrought by the villains of the wild. The frontiers demanded a blade, and so I heeded. Hmm. Um. Let's see. It's nice to finally put a face to the name, let's say that. And it's nice to meet someone of your talents. Having a worm wriggling in my skull didn't instill much confidence in the days ahead. With you as my ally, the future looks a little less daunting. He does sound more like a paladin than a warlock, but I like him. I, I know you guys were saying last stream that there's a lot of, like, hate on Will, but I'm like, so far, the dude is pretty mannerly. He can hold his own in a battle. And, like, he's nice to chat with. I'd like you to join me. That's the spirit. Okay, now let's level up good old Will. Beartastic, you like his personality, but not how he plays in combat. Health increased, class feature, he got another warlock spell. Okay. Now, burning hands, charm person, command, command a creature to flee, move closer, free, drop to the ground, or drop its weapon. Ooh, that sounds great. Uh, expeditious retreat, gain dash immediately, hellish rebuke, ooh, that's nice too, hex, make your attacks deal an additional 1 to 6 necrotic damage. Protection from good and evil, or Witch Bolt. Um, I like command. I don't feel like we have anyone else that, like, has something like that, do we? Eldritch Invocations. In your study of occult lore, you have unearthed Eldritch Invocations. Fragments of forbidden knowledge that imbue you with an abiding magical prowess. We can either do Agonizing Blast. When you cast Eldritch Blast, add your Charisma Modifier to the damage it deals. Oh, my Charisma Modifier is nice. Armor of Shadows. You can cast Mage Armor on yourself at will without using a spell slot. Um, beast Speech. Speak with animals at will. Now nah, we have a necklace that lets us do that right now. Beguiling Influence. You invoke your patron's bewitching charm. You gain proficiency in persuasion and, pers and deception. No, Belladonna already has that. Here, I'm going to do Agonizing Blast at first. Let's see what else we have. Devil's Sight. You can see normally in darkness. Uh, fiendish Vigor. You can cast False Life on yourself returned. without expending a... Uh, which gives you seven temporary hit points. Mask of Many Faces. One with Shadows. Repelling Blast. Um, so we do Agonizing and Repelling Blast. Then that means that our Eldritch Blast would be awesome. Thieve of Five Fates. You can cast Bane. Targets up to three creatures. They get a 1d4 penalty. That's cool too. I think we max out... Eldritch Blast. That seems really cool. I think we already have someone with Dark Sight. Who 2099, welcome back. Okay. Uh, we still have, oh, and we're leveling up again now. So let's see what we've got. Blindness, Cloud of Daggers, Crown of Madness, Darkness, and Thrall, Hold Person, Invisibility, Mirror Image, Hellish Rebuke, uh, Charm, Burning Hands, Shatter, Scorching Ray, Ray of Enfeeblement, Misty Step. Um, all right, let's see. Instill madness in a humanoid enemy, making them attack the creature closest to them other than you, uh, even if it's allied. Ooh, that's nice. Although darkness is good too. Crown of madness or darkness? I don't know. Hold person is good too. I'm, I'm between crown of madness and darkness. Darkness. 
Cloud of Swords has saved your butt quite a few times. Um. Oh, the Cloud of Daggers. Oh, because it attacks everyone inside. It, it attacks everyone inside for 4 to 16. That's pretty awesome. You know what? I'll take your word for it. Let's get that one. Our Pact Boon. Your patron bestows a gift upon you for your loyal service. Pact of the Chain. Gain the service of a familiar, a fey spirit that takes the form of your choosing. Pact of the Blade. You can summon a packed weapon or bind one you're wielding, making it magical. Pact of the Tome. Your patron grants you a grimoire called the Book of Shadows, which allows you to cast Guidance, Vicious Mockery, and Thorn Whip. Uh, I mean, let's get a buddy, right? Do we want a familiar, an imp, or a quasit? It can scare enemies, um, it can sting enemies, or whatever we want. Nah, I feel like an imp would be cool. Okay. All right. Well, hey, Will. Can you wanna you wanna make a buddy? Oh, did we not get imp? We only got familiar. Maybe I messed it up. I must have messed it up. All right. Well, let's get a familiar at least. Oh, here. Find familiar spider, raven, rat, um, frog, crab, cat. Ah, uh, here we go. Here's... I want, I want an imp, man. Yay! Will's got a buddy! All right, cool. I am into it. What to do? All right, now remind me, friends. Is there like a fast travel here? How do we get back to I'll catch a break. the map from here? Uh, Withers is over there. Like, how do we get back? Oh, here, leave camp. I see. I see. We can go right to the Overgrown Ruins or the Emerald Grove. We're going to go back to the Emerald Grove. All right. Now, let's see. We are... Yes, we're here. That's where the goblin entrance was. So, up here, find the Githyanki Crash to find Zoru. Find Donnie to investigate the beach. Save the refugees. Hunt down Carlac. Rescue the Druid Halson. I mean, it seems like rescuing the Druid Halson is, like, our main objective, but so many things are right up in here. Should we just, I feel like maybe we should, like, just go up here and, like, one, two, three, four, five? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I can't really get down there right now. You said there's actually some good things at the harpy area? Doesn't feel like it right now. All right, we're making our way. We're going to go back into town. Well, the harpy area was, like, up that way. I don't care for Red meat. Now, that's a different rare as can be. Dripping. Okay, it looks like there's someone we need to talk to. Looks like there's someone up here we need to talk to. From the map. No? I need a quick word. I haven't seen a single goblin. That's good, isn't it? Yeah. Alright, so I didn't really need to talk to you. Um, 
Who do we need to talk to? We need to go up and talk to Zevlor. So we'll go around this way, I guess, since we're up here. Oh, have I not gone up this way yet? I guess I haven't. Oh no! Wait, what's going on here? This poor person was about to be attacked by a bugbear? No. Your enemies are surprised. Okay. Uh, Imp goes first? I mean, Imp is in the worst position to go first. This feels good. Let's let Astarian go first, maybe. On the way. And then... Hamstring this dude. Hamstrung, that's right. He's gonna have half the movement. It's a glorious thing we love to see. I could do a flourish. Disengage. Just like old times. No, no hide. No hide available. It's fine. End his turn. Imp, we're just gonna have you come closer up into the battle. Uh, flies to target position, dismiss, summon. No, you're fine. We'll leave you there. Bugbear surprised, can't move. Um, no time to waste. You can come up here. I could have you main hand attack, flourish, piercing strike. Do you not have anything ranged? Oh, you've got Eldritch Blast, which we like made super OP. Yeah! <laughs> Bugbear off the <laughs> Whoopsie doozle. <laughs> Still alive. So that's progress. That was great. You have good timing. Never been much of a fighter, so wrestling a bugbear would have gone poorly. But you're not here for heroics, are you? Avernus's stench is all over your skin. What? Let me guess. Your devil mistress sent you to get her soul coin back. What? Too bad. I earned it, fair and square. I have no idea what you're talking about. Coin mistress, you lost me. I've been to Avernus, but I'm no devil's servant. That bugbear would have crushed your skull. This is the thanks I get, or you got me. Hand over the coin and I'll be on my way. Uh, I'm gonna say that bugbear would have crushed your skull. This is the thanks I get. Why, thank you, Dread Slayer of Bugbears. Ooh! You shall live forever in my memory. This lady is a B-word. Now take that pouting ironies and leave me alone. Ooh, you know what? Intimidation. How about this? You give me the coin now. You want to be a jerk? I'll be a jerk. And I have an intimidation proficiency. And I'm going to add guidance. Difficulty class five. Eat it. Eat it. You were rude. This is on you. Considering you turned that bugbear into paste, that's a fair trade. Mm-hmm. Here, take this soul back to the damned place it came from. A soul coin, true to its name, holds. This is like my third soul, soul coin now. I didn't even need this. It she was just rude. Helms is very valuable currency. Yeah, she was just totally rude. Maybe next time, don't be so rude to the people that saved your life, and you'll get to keep your soul coin. Folks, I am going to save the game here, because this is where I need to end the stream. Logan has his back-to-school night tonight, so I'm going to go get to meet his teacher. Uh, but yeah, that, that character gave me some shade, and it didn't work out for her, did it? So maybe next time, be a little more polite to the adventuring party you meet. Um, but we did totally obliterate that bugbear. Uh, folks, I will be streaming tomorrow, so please pay attention to the schedule in Discord. I gotta run super quicksy like, so I'm not gonna set up a raid or anything like that, but I'll see y'all on the morrow. Have a great day, everyone. Bye!